Hello friends, welcome to my channel Tech Classes. This video is the second part of the playlist that is data analysis using Python. In the first video, we have discussed about what topics we are going to cover in the whole playlist. In this video, we will be talking about first what is data, then we will see the difference between data and information. Moving further in the video, we will discuss about what are the different types of data and in last we will see what are the different sources from which a data can be collected okay so this will be discussed in how data will be collected okay so these topics we are going to discuss in this video so let's start with what is data let's understand what exactly a data is data is a collection of unstructured facts and details such as text observations figures symbols and object descriptions so it is a collection of unstructured means that has no structure so data has no structure and it will give some information about a person or a object so data are a set of values that can be qualitative or quantitative we talk about the qualitative and quantitative when we talk about the types of data so just understand these are the set of values that will give some information about a person or an object so data can be anything if you talk about physically then anything written on a piece of paper will be called as data so your notebooks books documents if anything is written on that then that will be called as a data now if we talk about data mainly in the field of science then the answer to what is data will be that data is different types of information that usually is formatted in a particular manner all the software is divided into major categories two major categories that is first one is programs and the second one is data so programs are the collection made of instructions that are used to manipulate data okay we used to write programs to manipulate data growth in the field of technology specifically in smartphones or laptops has led to text video and audio that is also included under data plus the web and log activity records as well so these all are data examples okay if you see images videos audios text messages that will be also a data so you have also seen a data in the form of table so data will be represented in the form in the table in the form of rows and columns so that will be a structured data so we will talk about this structured and unstructured data when we talk about the types of data different types of data there the data is divided into a structured and unstructured data so you can also say a data is information that has been translated into a form that is efficient for movement or processing so although the terms data and information are often used interchangeably the term has different meanings the two different terms that is data and information has different meaning so let's see the difference between the data and the information so before understanding the difference i will give you a idea about the information so information is organized or classified data which has some meaningful values for the receiver and information is the process data on which decisions and actions are based so simply we can call information as a process data means if a data means if we have a data and if we have perform any processing or analysis then it will be converted into an information so data can be converted into information i will just write this as data will be converted to information if we apply analysis on this analysis okay if we apply analysis on the data then it will be converted into information so let's see the difference between the data and the information so talking about the data it is unorganized and unrefined facts okay data is unorganized and unrefined facts so these are not organized but if you talk about the information then these are 
organized, processed, and that data that is presented in a meaningful context. Okay, so it has some specific meanings, and it is also in an organized format. So it comprises of processed. organized data now the second difference data is an individual unit that contains raw materials which do not carry any specific meaning which do not carry any specific meaning so data does not have any meaning okay it does not represent any specific meaning whereas the information it is a group of data that collectively carries a logical meaning so if we convert data in, in, into an information then we can draw any specific meaning or insights from that information so it carries a logical meaning now the third difference is data does not depends on the information data does not depends on information whereas the information depends on data information depends on data now if you have heard about the raw data then raw data is something that information that has collected but not formatted or analyzed so it does not depends on information okay we can collect data from any source and it is not required to convert that into an information but if we want to convert the data into an information then we should first have the raw data on which we can apply some analysis or processing or manipulation then we can draw some insights that can be called as a information so if we want to get the information then the data is required so i hope you have understood what is the basic difference between a data and information that's all for this video in the next video we will see the remaining topics that are types of data and how data will be collected and if you find this video helpful then do like this video and subscribe to my channel thank you bye and take care